The frigid air will actually stay in the northern plains over the weekend. And on Friday, we got a weak little disturbance coming in and see the little band of snow. It could drop one to two inches of snow for us. Um, basically Friday evening and Friday night. And then a second area comes in on Saturday through uh, Sunday morning. And we're in this little one to three inch band. And that's probably all we're going to get around here on the two episodes of snow Friday night and Saturday night. Look at these high temperatures. International Falls high temperature five below zero one below at the Twin Cities. We were eight degrees today, so we never got into the double digits and we're going to be very chilly overnight tonight. We're already down to three in Port Washington and Sheboygan and West Bend down to one in Waukesha, four Burlington, seven Milwaukee Racine and also Kenosha. Our wind chills are going to be actually lower right now than they will be later with the colder temperatures because the winds are really going to go calm overnight tonight 14 below zero is what it feels like right now in Waukesha 10 below West Bend 10 below Port Washington and 12 below in Sheboygan the winds very very light out of the southwest through the evening hours then becoming calm after midnight that will allow temperatures to really drop 10 below West Bend 11 below Fond du Lac 10 below Watertown about five below in Milwaukee again the coldest we've had this month is three below so the last day of the month could be the coldest day of the month and we also see the clearing skies Lake Michigan we have a lot of open water now because of the thaw last week and so we're actually seeing some snow showers develop when you have a cover of ice you don't get any evaporation so you don't get those snow showers and then the next weather system is developing over the mountains that'll be rolling in here by late tomorrow so as you see cold overnight tonight bitterly cold in the morning then we start a big warm-up and you'll see the snow developing very late probably in the evening hours and then the second area of snow for saturday develops out to the west and moves in here late saturday afternoon and saturday night 20 tomorrow as those winds turn more south to southeast and the snow starts to move in our direction 18 madison and again most of the snow holds off to friday evening tonight clear cold 10 below inland, five, uh, 5 below in the city, could see wind chills to 15 below early. Tomorrow, increasing clouds and the snow develops very late. We're up to 20 degrees on southeast winds. And then uh, tomorrow night, we get most of our snow. One to two inches are likely, 12. And on Saturday, snow showers begin very late in the afternoon again, one to three inches through Saturday night high 18. Here is your Storm Team 4 10-day outlook. Sunday, some flurries or snow showers left over. 15 degrees, Monday only 17 and partly cloudy. March starting out like a big lion. Mm. 20s through most of next week. We could see 30s on Thursday and then we could see 30s return next weekend.